gentleness, soft or low, polite, refined, not severe, rough or violent, but calm. You will know that you are abiding in my spirit by believing and resting in my promises and words so much to the point where your heart and mind are set on the things above of the kingdom of heaven. The spirit of the world and the spirit of God cannot coexist. Where there is corruption or worldliness in you, my peace will cease and vanish and you will be turned over to confusion and torment and darkness yet again. All of you is required to abide in my spirit and bear my fruit. You cannot have one foot in and one foot out and expect to reap the fruit of the spirit. There will be confusion, conviction, guilt, and torment. The fruit of gentleness is evidence of your contentment being fully one with me, regardless of your circumstances and worldly and temporal conditions, because you are hidden in the realm of the spirit, our secret place, buried in hope and faith, your eyes and heart not consumed and tainted with the evil of this world. You are at peace and stillness in me as your love. Your spirit is not troubled or vexed because as you are hidden in my light, all types of darkness have to flee. You are content with my peace that surpasses all understanding, guarding your heart from all darkness. Therefore, our fellowship will manifest through a gentle and quiet spirit.